Okay, so today's amino acid is arginine. So here's a model of arginine right here. Here's the, the alpha carbon amine carboxylic acid. This is protonated, this is deprotonated. And so arginine has a beta carbon, gamma, delta. Then there's this, this uh, guanidino group on the end. Now, this 3D print is actually a little bit um, off because um, the protonation isn't quite right. My student that printed this didn't quite get it wrong. There should be, to be fully protonated, which it should be, if this is fully protonated, well, there should be an extra proton on here, right? So it's a little bit of a misnomer um, because the pK of this is about nine. And um, this, the amine should deprotonate first, and then this is about 12. So this should then deprotonate last, right? So that's arginine either way. Um, protonation is a little bit off, but now how is arginine important, right? So this is a semi-essential amino acid. That means adults can synthesize arginine, but uh, children and uh, um, athletes and people recovering from uh, injury don't, cons don't synthesize enough for their needs. So then it needs to be consumed in the diet. So that's why it's semi-essential. Um, you can obtain arginine from nuts, seeds, uh, some meats and uh, legumes as well. Um, now, arginine is an important precursor of nitric acid or nitri nitric oxide. <laughs> um, and so that's a, an, a very important signaling molecule that helps relax blood vessels and improve blood flow and also regulate blood pressure, hence why it's important for athletes as well. And so it's also included in sports supplements um, and it's studied for heart health and circulation. It's also important in the urea cycle because this guanidino group over here, this is removed as urea and the rest of it becomes citrulline, which goes back into the mitochondria completing the urea cycle. So that's your body's main way of excreting nitrogen. So it's really important in nitrogen balance. It's important for protein synthesis and cell division. Um, also for tissue repair, wound healing, and even immune function. So this is a very important amino acid, arginine. And uh, that's the structure of arginine right there.